Have you ever wondered if there's more to life than what we can see, touch, or measure? We all have a natural proclivity to question what we don't understand. We're creatures of curiosity, aren't we? Yet, when it comes to spiritual awakening, skepticism often takes the front seat. The initial mindset is often rooted in a realm of logic and science. The tangible, the measurable, the observable. These become our comfort zones. We reject notions of spirituality, attributing them to folklore, myth, or sheer coincidence. After all, if we can't prove it, it doesn't exist, right? This was the world I lived in. A world where every phenomenon had an explanation, every event had a cause, every effect, a reason. Spirituality was a realm I scoffed at, dismissing it as an escape for those unable to face the harsh realities of existence. This was my mindset too, until something extraordinary happened. So, what if I told you? You could instantly take control over an incredibly powerful subconscious force that's right under your nose? Curious? I'll leave a link in the description below this video to discover the secret to getting exactly what you want in life. Now, an unexpected event can sometimes shake the very foundation of our beliefs. It was an ordinary Tuesday morning when the world as I knew it took an unexpected turn. The sun was shining, the birds were chirping, and life seemed to be going on as usual. But inside, a storm was brewing. My beloved grandfather, a stalwart figure in my life, had passed away. His sudden departure from this world into the next left me grappling with a profound sense of loss and a flurry of unanswered questions. His death was not just a personal tragedy, it was a jolt to my very understanding of life and existence. It sparked a curiosity within me, a curiosity about the very essence of life, about what happens when we leave this physical world. This curiosity was not just a fleeting thought, but a persistent echo that reverberated in the chambers of my mind. There was a whirlpool of emotions, a maelstrom of confusion and sorrow. I felt like I was standing at the edge of an abyss, staring into the unknown. Yet amidst the chaos, there was a strange sense of calm, a quiet whisper that urged me to seek answers, to find a sense of understanding beyond the physical world. It was during this time of emotional turmoil that I found myself drawn towards spirituality. I yearned for a deeper understanding of life and death, of purpose and existence. I wanted to explore the mysteries that lay beyond the veil of the physical world. I wanted to know if there was more to life than what meets the eye. This life-changing event, as heart-wrenching as it was, became a catalyst for a profound transformation. It was as if a door had opened to a world I had never considered before, a world where the spiritual and the physical intertwined, a world that promised answers to my deepest questions and solace to my aching heart. This event was the seed that sprouted my spiritual journey. The start of a journey is often filled with doubts and fears, but also a glimmer of hope. As I dipped my toes into the vast ocean of spirituality, I was greeted by a world teeming with a myriad of philosophies and perspectives. A whole new universe opened up before me, filled with concepts as ancient as the hills, yet as fresh as the morning dew. During this initial phase, I consumed countless books, each one offering a unique perspective on the mysteries of the universe. I delved into the teachings of spiritual gurus like Eckhart Tolle, Deepak Chopra, and Paulo Coelho, each one peeling back the layers of my understanding, revealing new dimensions of thought and existence. I also found myself attending seminars and workshops, immersing myself in the wisdom shared by spiritual teachers from around the globe. The energy in these spaces was palpable, a collective yearning for understanding, a shared pursuit of truth. But it wasn't just about solitary exploration. The journey also led me to cross paths with some truly remarkable individuals. Conversations with these fellow seekers were enlightening, their experiences and insights adding new colors to the tapestry of my understanding. Yet, this journey was not without its challenges. As someone with a background in science, I grappled with reconciling my logical, rational mind with the intangible, often inexplicable experiences I was encountering. It was like trying to fit a square peg into a round hole. I found myself at the crossroads of science and spirituality, two worlds that often seemed at odds with each other. Yet, the more I delved into both, the more I began to see the parallels, the intersections, the places where they met and merged. It was a struggle, yes, but one that was necessary, one that forced me to question, to challenge, to seek. It was a struggle that in many ways became the fuel for my journey. Despite the struggles, I found myself drawn deeper into the world of spirituality, the allure was irresistible, the pursuit of understanding too compelling. And so the journey continued, into the unknown, 
into the depths of the self, into the heart of existence. When the mind opens up to new possibilities, the transformation begins. This was the mantra that began my shift, my metamorphosis, from skeptic to believer. It was not an overnight change, rather a gradual process, like the slow turning of the seasons. As I delve deeper into my journey, I found myself confronted with experiences that could not be explained away by logic or science alone. There were moments of synchronicity, where the universe seemed to align in such a way that was too precise to be mere coincidence. There were instances of intuition, where knowledge seemed to arise from a source beyond my conscious mind. These experiences began to chip away at the wall of skepticism I had built around myself. In addition to these personal experiences, there was the newfound knowledge that I was accumulating. I began to read widely, absorbing wisdom from spiritual texts, scientific studies, and the accounts of others who had walked this path before me. I began to see patterns, connections, a grand tapestry of existence that was far more intricate and beautiful than I had ever imagined. This combination of personal experiences and newfound knowledge led me towards acceptance and understanding. I began to see that spirituality was not about blind faith, but about openness, about curiosity, about seeking to understand the mysteries of existence. I was no longer a skeptic, I had become a believer. The transformation was profound and it was profound because it was personal. It was my journey, my awakening, and it continues to this day. Every journey is unique, but the destination can be shared. Whether skeptic or believer, each of us has a spiritual side waiting to be explored. It's a quest for truth, a pursuit of the profound, and it's yours to undertake. So I invite you to delve into the depths of your soul, to question, to seek, to discover. You never know, your unbelievable spiritual awakening might just be around the corner. So are you ready to transform your life and reach levels of success and happiness that you never dreamed possible? Then click the link in the description below this video to discover the secret to getting exactly what you want in life. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. And don't forget to leave a comment below letting me know what you think.